what's going on guys i just thought i would do another quick video um let you know how it was going with the dump trailer rental um this is my third or fourth trip and i have been renting it out to a local roofing company um i would like to share a lot of details about that and how it's going um, what I see that I like, what I see that I don't like. So, um, headed to the dump now with a very heavy load of shingles. It was a house that had, um, that has already had a roof before. And the last roofing company, they just laid shingles over old shingles. Um, so we had to make two different trips. So that, that, that was kind of, um, it was just a really heavy load and we had to split it up into two loads so um i will tell you more about the fees that they are charging me um and uh, you know and again what i like about it and what i don't like about it so um i will add some more to this video What's going on guys? I am back again with um, another part to this video. I just uh, hooked up my truck again to the dump trailer. I have a um, local roofing company that wants to use it. They're on a job pretty close to me tomorrow. Um, they had used me earlier on in the week. I'm still going to explain kind of the um, just the ins and outs of what I'm trying to do with this trailer and all of that good stuff. Um, this roofing company is really the first customer other than what I normally use the trailer for um, or would use the trailer for in my normal business. They're the first company that has rented it from me and I've just been pretty much trying to stay there with it if I can so um, I have it hooked up again for tomorrow they have a roof nearby and they want to use it um, to put all of the old shingles in and uh, and haul off so I will be back with more very soon Okay guys, I am back with the last part of this video. Um, first customer that I've been renting the dump trailer to is a local roofing company. Um, the guy is actually a really good friend of mine and um, I think he was kind of doing it to help me out because he knew that I was slow in my other business and that I had just kind of started doing this on the side. Um, this is dump one of two for this last house um, that I am doing for this roofing company. Um, I had to spend about 20 minutes trying to rake some of the shingles from the front of the trailer to the back because it had the tundra just squatting so low. Um, the chains were already crossed a couple of times and the chains were still touching the ground so um, it is just a heavy load uh, there's nails everywhere um, probably gonna be a two hundred and fifty dollar dump bill I figure I've got six to seven thousand pounds worth of weight on the trailer um, you know I, I'm so thankful to get these um, couple of rentals but we had already decided that we were just going to use um you know the trailer for household debris only um and then just really haven't had a ton of requests so um went ahead and rented to this roofing company but it is so much wear on the trailer it's so much wear on the truck the weight is so heavy um you know and obviously this guy is going to pay more than you know a normal day of rental um 
which is in the ballpark of $200. So um, long story short, I don't think I would advise to rent it to any kind of roofing companies, maybe contractors that are doing remodeling or something like that. But, um, you know, it, it, it's just, um, I think that in the long run, using it to haul roof and shingles, I think you're just gonna get a bunch of nails in your truck tires and in your trailer tires. And I think it's gonna be more trouble and more wear on your equipment than what it's worth. So um, hopefully I can market it a little bit better um, I can do another video on the marketing as well, but I'm still learning a lot. So, um, but I'm out on renting it to roofing companies as I just think it's just more trouble than what it's worth. So, um, I will get all of my stuff together and try to do a few more videos, um, in the next couple of days. So I hope that this helps. Um, I hope that uh, if any of you guys are like me and you're just trying to start out into this, and I, you know, I hope that this kind of gives an insight, um, you know, and and that it can help some of you. So thank you for watching. Um, if you want to follow along in our journey, just hit subscribe, and uh, we will be back soon with some more videos. Thanks.